And good morning. It has been a violent weekend here in Chicago or police headquarters. Uh, at least 63 people shot over the weekend, three fatalities. And last night there were two mass shootings and 17 people were struck in those two separate incidents. There was one shooting in the Chicago Lawn neighborhood, 63rd and Artesian. 11 people shot at that location. They were outside at a gathering. Police say that three males emerged from an alley and opened fire. A woman was shot in the chest and died at University of Chicago hospitals. Four other women and six males were wounded. Some of the victims got themselves to Holy Cross Hospital. In the South Shore neighborhood, a drive-by shooting at 71st and Clyde, five males and a female were standing outside. A black SUV drove past and someone inside started shooting. The female was shot six times and was pronounced dead at University of Chicago Hospital. The males in their 20s were wounded. A 15-year-old suffered wounds to the foot and knee and was taken to Comer Children's Hospital. In Chicago, it appears it is not safe to gather outdoors. Gatherings now have changed. You know, you gather, nobody's watching, people are emerging from alleys, people are doing drive-bys, and you have multiple people shot. And then some of them are succumbing to their injuries. Then some have permanent damage. And in all, eight Chicago area hospitals were busy treating gunshot wound vi victims last night. Andrew Holmes says that it was a chaotic night with families driving all over the city trying to find their loved ones. And we know of no arrests in connection with these shootings. Reporting live, I'm Joni Lum. Now back to you.